five stairs today before the season, and I got down here really late last night. <clears throat> Pulled into a spot about, I don't know, 1 a.m. or so, a little after 1, and woke up this morning, climbed up a hill, and I glassed three bucks, one of which I think was like in the 90, 95 inch range. So I text Matt, said, hey, got bucks. He's like, are they shooters? I'm like, well, one of them's good, but he's not a slob. And Matt's response back was, dude, we're hunting slobs. So <laughs> I'm like, well, you're going to have to carry my bullets. But uh, now I am in a new location. I got to climb a hill. Got to climb that hill right there. And I'm going to glass and see if I can find something better, something sloppier this evening, so we'll see how it goes. Only judge by God and the fruits that they've dropped Unless they rot All the weeds that they grew Are never ending They slave the whole human race Making dollars off our fate While your hands getting stained And transaction time is all we got left So count your cards and hold your breath Or the fool's state of mind But hey, it's a paycheck, it's a paycheck God only Mr. Matt Cullip. What's up, brother? Ready to kill a looking, big f***ing deer? Looking for slobs, man. Looking for slobs. It's gonna be a good morning. So that just happened. Weird now. I got it. I got it. Some bloody hands. Matt and I came up here where we're at right now. Around 11, I guess. And Owen went straight back to where we had been, where we watched those two little bucks. Just got back to the truck. We're gonna kinda head up into a new area. Owen's gonna hang out where we were watching those deer. And he's gonna see if we can find something else. I went back to the truck and Came running up there, he's like, dude, I got a buck. So I came back up here, got Matt, and we went over there and, and uh, shot him. And uh, shot him. I nicked him on the first shot. And the second shot, I could only see his ass standing behind a tree. So I spined him in the hindquarters. And then uh, 
uh, hit him again in the lungs as he was kind of rolling down the hill. I hit him one last time in the lungs. I kind of put him down. Done. We cleaned him up, took some pictures, packed him out, and now we're back up on the hill we're trying to find another buck for Matt. He, uh, he and Owen stayed back a little bit. I'm just gonna walk down here a little bit. I'll be able to see into this cut a little better. So, we're find a buck for Matt. Probably a big one too, because if you shoot a buck like the one I shot, you'll never shoot one like the buck Matt shoots. So he kills, he says that he's got like 10 bucks over 110, you know? It's because he doesn't shoot the, the 80 inch bucks, the 85 inch bucks like that one. Look, not like you smoked too much weed. Like that. <laughs> Slept with my contacts in and uh, thought I was blind this morning when I got up. Are you filming? Yes, sir. So, the glass in this bowl right here. Our best bet is to spread out probably over a quarter mile along this. Let's see what we can see. Saw some little books yesterday, but super windy, everything was bedded down. So hopefully we find that monster, sticks his head out, and we'll get it done. It. 
spot. I'm gonna have to go try to find this thing. Hold ass that way. And it may be hard as shit to find, but. Loaded him up, he's here on the stone glacier, right there, and he's making a trip back to my truck, or I'll tube him out and we'll drop him off at the taxidermist to get that skin tanned. I'm super excited about it, I, I love bobcats, bobcats and coos deer. It's on it already, 1-1. One, one. These are cute, did you get these at Toys R Us? I did. They're super, super sweet. One, one? Yeah, it should be on it already. Yeah, full better. All right, check. All right, well, let's march. Sun's setting. Oh, shot. 